Hey friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Nimmi Vincent. In this video, I'll be demonstrating how to apply for loop in Python programming with some examples. Let me open Python programming in my computer system. This is the Python shell window of the version 3.8.3. 32 bit. When a statement or a group of statements need to be repeated in a program, it can be included in a loop. A loop statement that is used in Python is called for loop. Suppose you need to create a Python program to display the multiples of 7 below 200. How can we make one Python program for this? First you have to type the command for command. After that you can give any variable name which can be labeled as any letter from A to Z in the alphabet. So here I'll be giving the alphabet K the letter came for the variable so after 4 you have to give one space then you have you can specify the variable name here I'll be typing K for the variable then after that one space then you can type in then again space uh, range then within the bracket you can specify the parameters of the for statement so here I'll be giving the starting value 7 because we have to display the multiples of 7 less than 200 so here I'll be giving the value 200 all 201 so here I'll be typing 201 after that comma then the third value is the incre increment of the variable k so here the increment should be 7 because we are going to display the multiples of 7. After that, close the bracket. Then, as per the syntax of for command, we have to give colon mark to end the statement. After that, I'll be leaving some spaces. Then, I'll be typing the print command to display the value of k which is increased by 7 in each statement. Now our program is completed. I'll be pressing enter key. Again one more time enter key. Now here you can view the list of multiples of the number 7. If you want to display the multiples of 5 which is less than 201 instead of 7 here you can change and you can type instead of 7 5 now just imagine you have to prepare a python program to find the sum of the even numbers from 2 to 50 so how can be the program first you can keep one variable s to store the sum of the numbers so here s it can be its initial value can be 0 because at the beginning of the program uh, we didn't add any numbers so s equals 0 then we can type the for command here to save the time let me copy and paste this command for command for that just click select with the mouse then you can use control key control and c to copy and control and v to paste it so here i'll be making some changes uh, in range here you can give two because we have to find the sum of even numbers from two so the starting value is two and it should be less than it should be up to 50 that means 52 we can give or 
51 you can give 51 or 52 like that we can give after that you can give the increment of the variable k so here the increment can be 2 so the variable k will be increased by 2 after that you have to press the colon then leave some space then you can give the value to the variable s we can type like this s equals s plus k after that press enter key then you can press enter key to type the next command so here i'll be typing the total sum of the even numbers from 2 to 50 press enter key so here the total value is 650 i hope that this program uh, this video give you more information about for loop in python programming if you like this video please hit the like button if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel yet you can subscribe to my youtube channel for the new contents and please share my video see you in the next video till then bye bye